Hello everybody, this is Matt Cat Spear, and uh, um, I'm here to upload a little video to talk about on the Delta brainwaves. Um, recently, um, I've had some very good news about it because uh, I've had this theory since when I first started psychokinesis way back that um, that your soft, subtle uh, mental state, which is like your uh, sleepy dream state, your waking dream state, what I, what I would consider it to be, is affecting the objects to be affected by your mind and by your, your physical presence. But I didn't know exactly in detail what it was. I just knew that it was a fusion of the of the dream fantasy state fusing with the waking reality state. And recently, I had uh, that confirmation right now um, from um, the telekinesis mind possible guy, his channel. And uh, he said that he had this EEG monitoring device on his head. He saw that when he was moving the object, that the delta waves were much more, highly more affected, uh, uh, occurring a little bit before or after, sometimes after of the object would move with this psychokinesis. Uh, the scientists recently, or just maybe like a few months ago or something like that, found out that in death, in death, that 10 minutes after death, Again, the delta brain waves are uh, triggered, are triggered even after death. There, there's signs of it that the delta brain waves are the final waves that you have 10 minutes after your heart is stopped, and your respiratory system is stopped, and, and the blood flow is stopped, and, and and what they think like the like like the neurological uh, um, stops too. You know the the activity of the brain. The only thing we have is delta. That's what comes. So these, my theory, uh, my own personal theory. The, the 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 EEG of study done by um, the telekinesis mind possible gentleman on YouTube his channel and recently by uh, the scientists of near death and uh, death studies that found out that in death ten minutes after death you get delta brain waves and with telekinesis mind possible you get delta brain waves by the EEG studies while you're perf while you're awake performing psychokinesis and so. This is a great thing. Uh, my theory was proved correct. Uh, that, uh, well, what it is is that um, what I'm trying to say is that I'm, I was proved right. My theory was correct. But the but since what what is happening is that your spirit is um it, it's like opening a valve or or, or 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 slightly opening a door when you're um, allowing your mind to relax in a certain uh, certain uh, position. Um, you, you allow your spirit to kind of flow in and connect for brief moments. It's like opening this thing, the, like the dam of the water, I guess, or like a door or something. And you're, the, the delta brain waves is that opening to allow the spirit to kind of come through your, your, uh, your supernatural spirit energy to move the objects. And what that means, and, and, and the confirmation also comes from death, which is the last brain wave. I think that the delta brain wave is closely related to the spiritual side, delta brainwaves are, are connected to the because what it is that when you're asleep, your 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 body and your brain is completely relaxed, and then you're able to uh, um, uh, allow yourself to travel or astral project, uh, allowing your body to travel and to astral project and connect with the spiritual the spiritual side, and then in death when you die, the delta brainwaves is basically signaling that the maybe the spirit is leaving the body in the last. The last fluctuation of the last breath is um, on, the, on the delta brain waves popping up, and and signaling that the that 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 the that the spirit is leaving the body or that it's uh, loosening up from the body, and and so the psychokinesis is deeply involved with delta brain waves, and I think that uh, Tre Trevor Seven has also mentioned this. I think he said that uh, that uh, like way, way before that, um, that, the, that I think that I think he maybe he did maybe I'm completely wrong. I'm gonna check on that, but. He says something that the that certain brain waves are involved in it, but the deltas are the main thing, mainly involved. It's the dream fantasy states that now is a dream fantasy spiritual state. It's all one thing. The dream and uh, um, on the fantasy and reality are fusing together. The spiritual is connecting to the physical world, and the only way you do that is by psychosis. And uh, the, my theory was proved correct by those uh, by those two great studies, and. Um, that, that that's basically what it is. I just wanted to spit that out there, get that out there for you guys. And uh, the delta brain waves are the main big big thing that's involved. And I think that's um, what it is that you're affecting the object and, and 
you're 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 awake but you're 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 in a sleep waking state is what it is and and in, in that state that balance while you're awake you're able to affect the object and it's a great uh, discovery and uh, i didn't want to give it too long and i want to share with you guys and uh the delta brainwave is involved in and um that that's basically it this is my cat sphere thank you guys for watching this one share with you guys